morning everyone I'm actually doing a scrap run I actually got to see the sunrise this morning we've got stainless steel on which is right here we've got all of our stainless steel up the front all of our sinks and god knows what um, we've got ordinary steel in the back here because I just didn't have enough room on the whole ute god damn I got it loaded springs are actually bowed backwards um, I've also got on here a bit of car steel, brake loaders, all that, mind the traffic. I'm directly across the road from the scrap metal place. Um, I've done an early start this morning. And uh, yeah, got to wait for it to open. So let's see how much we'll get out of that. That's a fair bit when you look from the front. A lot of weight. A lot of weight, a lot of, a lot of old washing machines that didn't work, uh, fridge motors that are in there, well, I've scrapped the whole motor apart, um, microwave shells, microwaves, it's all there, uh, yeah, like I said, stainless steel, uh, old beds, everything, so anyway, uh, I'm actually going to be leaving these big pods leaving them there that way they can just put the forks in down below here fork it off it's all scrap metal so we just gotta wait for it to open so stay tuned We weighed in at five and a half ton. Man, that's a lot. Right. Told him all my formalities and stuff like that. You're not wrong there. The rain last night was bad enough. Over there? I camped out on the road. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I started coming over last night, so yeah, because I didn't know what time you opened and things like that. So I thought, oh, because you got no reviews on Google. I've only sort of just got into the Google thing. All oh, right, yeah, yeah. yeah, but you're on Google. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go. Yeah, no, I, I prefer to bring it over myself. That way I know how much I, like, yeah, even though you just do weigh it, but it's a, the fact of, I get away from my own job. <laughs> you more you well, you haven't got the cost of, uh, say, you coming and picking it up. That's what I look at. Another one there. I made sure it was tied on. I have that. haven't had to check these. Pushed it on the whole lot. Made sure it wasn't going to move.
Now it will be dirty stainless because it'll be the parts out of the dishwashers. Yeah, it just goes in as miles. Oh, yeah. oh I, I look, I look at it as dirty. It's got that buddy. It's magnetic. No, it's not magnetic. That's the magnetic part. Um, I've separated it. So it's actual stainless, but it's got that black shit on, which you can get that off with uh, um, a, a heat gun. Oh yeah. We call it tip strap. Oh fair enough. That's all you get out of the tips is just your teams and bridges. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I've got um, a deal going with Harvey Norman over there. Yeah. Says so I'm taking it to landfill. Yeah, we'll see we go buy it off the we do all the tips too. Oh right, do you? Yeah, now, this bloody thing. Quickly, bloody thing. I got it. I'll do the work. Hey. I'll, I'll do the work, it's fine. <laughs> Inside of a hot water system. That's cast drum, isn't it? Oh, you're putting it there, eh? Yeah. You got it? Oh, yeah! What he's going to do with this, he's going to average it out. Still put it in one area, but um, yeah, average it out. Still a bit heavy yet. Jeff Warren, he gone. We got to shake that one. Oh, wait. There's two point five kgs just thrown. <laughs> wow. Yeah, it's a little bit heavy. I might be able to lift the bin, but I'm not lifting this one. Got a bit of weight in this. Still too heavy. 
good. Pick up what I've dropped on the ground. Where's that handle going? Is that a handle there? There it is. Right. That's uno done. Take that home, reuse it. Half a day to load this. Hung up. It's hung up. It's down. Oh dear. Yeah, you're good, mate. Do what you have to do. That I won't be able to lift off. I'm going to tar board off a trailer. Not my trailer. Uh, I'm buggered already. <laughs> Another bin. Stay. I better fix it up. Just give me a full empty bin. Never mind. Alright, oh, I'm not lifting that out. Alright. Damn. 
One by one, I suppose. We'll go to the trailer and unload the trailer. Well, that's going to be lifted off with the forks, I reckon. Come on, off you come. Zebos, Zebo frames. went over. <laughs> I've been no good at basketball, would I? I got that in the hole. Yeah. 
You don't take fridges, do you? Ah, uh, we take them, we just don't pay them. Thought so. Yeah, the other bloke down the road does, though. So. Doesn't pay me much, but, you know, because they're already contaminated from the foam inside, yeah? Yeah, yeah that's why. we sell them we get 50 bucks a ton so by the time we crush them yeah not it's not worth doing exactly it's almost a landfill job well that's where the hell come from yeah well i get the motors out you see yeah yeah Yeah, can something go through there. Plastic, I'll take it. That goes as my weight, doesn't it? <laughs> you don't, um, with circuit boards, just got a question for you. With see how that's got a little circuit board, you don't no, take don't those, really do e nah. yeah, yeah, so so. Now that's all stainless, yep, that's all right. Which one? This one? Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm not lifting it off. <laughs> There's uh, three of them there. Yeah, right. Uh, and this I can unload manually out if you want. Um, but yeah, I thought that one was full. I was getting up big. <laughs> oh, these I can just sit on the ground. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll just pick them up with a the excavator and chuck them in. Yeah, yeah. Um, these pieces up the top, I'll remove them so you can yeah. lift that off. That'll take all my weight off. You reckon you're able to lift this on the ground with the forks? I can skid it onto the forks for you. Yeah. Um, what I might do though, yeah. I'll take the tops up, I'll grab a bin. Yeah. And I'll you jump on the back of you and I'll bring a bin to you. Yeah, yeah that sounds alright to me. I can okay. just pull that straight in. If you want to do it that way, whatever's easiest. I'll grab one of these yeah, no worries. And I can manoeuvre this around while well, I park far right. enough forward so you can get the other one on the other side. Take it in, bro. Yeah, go back and let that drop. Then come forward. Go back and then come forward. That'll drop to the ground. There you go, come this way. This way. These have got a bit of weight in them. Keep coming. Till you touch. That'll do. didn't fit did it well that's it 
that can be forked off now. Through there. Worked out well, actually. Pull from up here. Yep, yep. Sweet heads. Can we get them ICBs? Yeah, you can get them. Yeah, they're all they're all separated. That weight off would be right. I feel these bin. That's the way to do it. You watch the load come off this. You kind of lift this off. You watch the vehicle come up. There's a lot of weight in those ICB bins. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, go up. Square yourself out, though. Go up four inches. Oh, you're all right. You go straight in. Yeah, 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 now you're doing well. Straighten your wheel out. Keep going. Yeah, you're a bit high, actually. Down, down, down. That's it. Go straight in. Come my way a bit. Oh, you can shuffle that across, can't you? Yeah, there you go. Keep going in. Keep going. Come my way with your fork. Oh, you got it. Go straight in. Lift that up there. You'll be lifting too, otherwise. Wow, that's a lot of weight. All right, just lift it straight up if you want. That way you don't catch on this and pull it on the ground. You're good. That makes it easy for you, doesn't it? <laughs> well, all the outer lining is TV shells. <laughs> and being pro productive. <laughs> I don't lose nothing. <laughs> that in there did you want to do that one too I can pull that around that way if you like Keep going straight in. Go up a little bit. Keep going up. Group. Straight in. Go that way with your fork. That's it. Straight in there. Wow. That's got a lot of weight. Right, get 
this other crap off. Springs are feeling a lot lighter, I reckon. Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. Yeah, that's only this. Keep coming. Hallelujah. And I'll pull it on. Yeah. I'll let you take that one. Way to pack it though, isn't it? A lot tidier for you. Hey. A lot tidier for you. Come up higher and we'll go under the tray and I'll lay it over. Oh, you're under. Yeah, now go on top of the tray. Okay. Keep coming up. Straight in there. Keep coming. Oop. Go down. That's it. There you go. You're just looking a lot happier. Yeah, you just about lost it there. It shuffled one way. <laughs> That'd be an awful mess. Did you want to? Oh, you're going to go the other side, are you? Right in.
that's what I was thinking. It's on. That's the go. It's all yours. Right in the bin. Careful with his equipment, this fella. Liking this fella. So he doesn't take e-waste. So that's fine with me. Look at that, it's up right now. He's in. He could have done that with the rest of these. Put them straight in. Never mind. Hope he can unload this the same way. Otherwise we'll be, we'll be scratching for it. Up, up, straight in, down. It's on. It's on. Just. Where are you putting it over there? I want the drum back. I can get that back out then. Right. So you're putting that over here? Yep. Oh, into that, okay. Can't hear him on that goddamn bloody fork. <laughs> yeah, these don't belong to me. <laughs> I've got to take them back. <clears throat> Unfortunately. It's the way of the world. You borrow something, you've got to take it back. Now, I've got a question for you. The Razor scooters and all that sort of thing, they're extruded, aren't they? Yeah. Alloy. Even though, they're, even though they're welded with the neck. Yeah, as long as you no plastic or bolts. No anymore. plastic, no bolts. I clean, as you can see, this is all pretty clean. No bugger all plastic in it. No point. You're trying to produce on so much plastic and you're getting, yeah. I get, you know, you don't get paid for plastic. Oh, I don't think. That's just the way I, the way I work. Like, little bits like that, I can't get off. Yeah. Too much, too time. Okay. Do you want it up 
up there too? Control. <laughs> Try to save space. We can see how much was on the view. Now look how it outlooks. <laughs> I had a fair bit. I would have yeah, been in the shed if I got pulled out by that buddy. Proper. Yep. Yeah, yeah, this side. Yeah, this side of the shed. Yeah, yes, three days. Well, I can be versing if you want. Makes it easy for me. So let's see what the steel was. Uh, what our stainless is going to be now. I'm not sure what the vehicle weighs. I think it's about 1800. They haven't got a scales outside, it's inside, so I'll have to go in and find out. <coughs> Which way? Oh, okay, yep, yep, yep. Glad I reversed him. Oh, I'll drop the tailboard down, make it easier. That's um, all stainless. I want the, I'll take the drum though. Yeah. You just wait the drum out yeah. after. <laughs> Sharp edges on that. That's not stainless. Yes, it is, bro. I'll grab some more smaller stuff. <coughs> Got a load of batteries coming in. Yeah, you dropped a load off just before when I, you unloading it as well. All oh, right. He's got some scrap for me. Ah, oh, fair enough. Yeah, I was thinking that.
but not least it took me a while to get this in here. Good sort of gate, isn't it? Done. Done. Wow. Is that all? <laughs> uh, I'll take five kilos off of that drum. Drum. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, it would only be probably two kilos, really. Because it's only a washing machine drum. Four hundred bucks a ton for that stuff. Yeah, well, that's good. Mm, so you'll have. So we had 5.5. So that's your gross. Yeah, 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 so we yeah. We off at two seven six eight. So you had yeah. two point seven four. All right. Yeah, yeah. Had ninety four kilos in that stuff. Since I had a bloody lot, didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> two point uh, seven ton, and I'll give him. All, I'll pull this out so you can deal with him, and I'll get all my details for yeah, you. Um, that way you can. Well, I'll give you a hand. How's that? No, actually, no, I'll, I'll wheel him up on the way bridge. Oh, all right. <laughs> Finally made it home, everyone. Um, had to wait for the email to come through for the receipt. But anyway, we got in total for pressing steel was... Tear weight was seven uh, two thousand seven hundred and sixty kilos, which is over two two and three quarter ton. Um, and well, that was tear weight, and the actual weight was two thousand seventy four kilos. That's still close to two and three quarter ton. Uh, Fifteen cents a kilo works out to be about a hundred. And, I think that's about one hundred and fifty dollars a ton. So we got $411 there in our uh, stainless steel alley solid. No, that's what they class it as, 194 kilos. Uh, actual weight was 194, even though he did take, I think he took uh, two or three kilos off for my plastic drum because I was bringing it home. So it was 40 cents a kilo, uh, $77.60, so it Grand total of, don't worry about the GST down the bottom, that's all included in it, uh, $488.60. So that'll be going very well to a Christmas present. So that's pretty good. I don't mind those figures. It's better than what I got in the very, very first scrap run that I got. It's just one of those things that happens when you go somewhere and you're not not sure about it. You think, well, I'm going to the right place, but um, at least that the place I went to was actually nice and tidy. Didn't mind that. I'm a bit of a clean freak myself. I like to have things nice and tidy and organised and all of that. So if it's not organised and not tidy, like I don't want, I'm just only new into this industry and that sort of thing. I'm scrapping out. So yes, um, I'll definitely be going back to that guy. So. Pretty good prices, I reckon. 15 cents a kilo. Yeah, $150 a ton. Definitely. Mmm. Loving the idea of that. Wait to see our copper price for our, for our next run. Hopefully that's very soon. But anyway, um, if you've come this far in the video, everyone, don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll definitely see you in the next one. Oh, and a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, everyone. So, cheerio.